What's up, YouTube? How's it going? Back again for another random video. I'm going to be talking to you guys about the Ontario point system and uh, how the points work for driving. Uh, in case you're wondering, you don't have a book nearby and uh, you're curious to know, because there's a lot of stuff on here. And uh, if you haven't figured any of them out, well, I'll tell you all of them, because there's a lot. So, the Dermot Point System. Demerit? However the fuck to say it. The Demerit Point System encourages drivers to improve their behavior and protects people from drivers who abuse the privilege of driving. Drivers convicted of, dri drivers convicted of driving related offenses have Demerit Points recorded on their records. Demerit Points stay on their record for two years from the day of the offense. If you accumulate too many demerit points, your driver's license can be suspended. So here we go. Six points, you will be told about your record and urged to improve your driving skills. So if you fuck up, up to six points. So that could just be two speeding tickets. If you get to nine points, you may have to go to an interview to discuss your record and give reasons why your license should not be suspended. You may also have a, a complete A driver re-examination. You may have to complete a, Wow, you might have to do the thing all over again. Wow. If you fail this test, your license can be canceled. If you fail to attend an overview, an interview, sorry, or fail to give good reasons for keeping your license, your license may be suspended. Now, if you reach 15 points, that's just fucking retarded. Your license will be suspended for 30 days from the date you hand over your license to the Ministry of Transportation. You can lose your license for up to two years if you fail to surrender it. After the suspension, the number of points on the driver's record will be reduced to seven. Any extra points could, again, bring you to the interview <coughs> level. If you reach 15 points again, your license will be suspended for six months. And this is not even talking about insurance. Some companies get so bad that they'll make you pay the whole year in advance. So, uh, don't fuck up. Here are the point systems. <clears throat> Seven points, failing to remain at the scene of a collision. So hit and run, dumbass. Failing to stop for a cop. <laughs> I got Dodge Charger with a Hemi and boy would that be a fun race. <laughs> uh, chase. <laughs> Six points, careless driving, racing, exceeding the speed limit by 50k or more, and you lose your vehicle. However that crap works, up to 10 grand, you can get a fine for. This is not counting money, this is just point system. You get dinged with tickets, insurance, and points. So watch how you drive. I'm serious, they are bitches. Failing to stop for a school bus. So when the school bus got to sign out, you don't stop. That's six points, because you could hit a kid. Oh. Five points, driving of a bus, driver of a bus failing to stop at unprotected railway crossing. So the bus driver goes through that, train comes, you didn't stop, kill those kids. Four points, exceeding the speed limit by 30 to 49 kilometers an hour. Falling too closely. So, uh, riding someone's ass. Is that before the ticket? Or is that before the accident? <laughs> or if a cop sees you doing that. Three points gets you exceeding the speed limit by 16 to 29 kilometers an hour. Driving through, around, or under a railway crossing barrier. Failing to yield the right of way. Failing to obey a stop sign, traffic light, or railway crossing signal. Failing to obey traffic control stop sign. Failing to obey traffic control slow sign. Failing to obey school crossing stop sign. Failing to obey the directions of a police officer. So when the traffic lights are out or there's an accident and he's telling you what to do and you don't listen and you cause an accident, you're an idiot. Driving the wrong way on a divided road. Now, I've done that, but I've had to do that to... I've gone down one way and there's a car dealership and uh, it was a really tiny road cars on both sides 
and I actually drove back out that way, but I did not see the one-way side. <laughs> oh, I wasn't looking, but uh, if a car came in, boom, I'm at fault. But it's a tiny road, obviously there's only one way to go in, right, but fuck, I didn't use my head. Um, failing to report a collision to a police officer. <clears throat> Improper driving where the road is divided into lanes. Crowding the driver's seat. Whatever that is. Going the wrong way on a one-way road. Now, these are all three points. Basically, like, uh, not following stop signs and crossings and crap. Driving a, or operating a vehicle on a closed road. Crossing a divided road where no proper crossing is provided. Failing to slow and carefully pass a stopped emergency vehicle. That's a new rule. I guess because people were driving so fast. Ba boom Hitting police officers. Flying through the air, I guess. Failing to move where possible. Oh, sorry. Uh, failing to slow. Okay. Failing to stop at a pedestrian crossing. So when people come out of Walmart, you don't stop. You're a dickhead. You get dinged a point. Someone can call you in. Uh, failing to move where possible into another lane. When passing a stopped emergency vehicle, driving a vehicle that is equipped with carrying or carrying a speed measuring warning device such as a radar detector. So you can't have uh, cop detectors, speed detectors. Oh shit, cops come. Beep, 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 beep. Slow down. Improper use of a high occupancy vehicle lane. So you're in a, like a carpool lane and you're by yourself on a moped or something. That's three points. Don't do that. <laughs> Two points is uh, failing to lower headlight beam. So I'm guessing... Uh, <laughs> Driving with your high beams on <laughs> gets you two points. Ouch. Fucking old people. I can't see the road. <laughs> Improper opening of a vehicle door. Jeez, I'm surprised HIDs don't give you a ticket. <clears throat> I've been flagged a lot. So, improper opening of a door. Okay. Prohibited turns, towing people on toboggans, bicycle skis, for example, failing to obey signs, but we have three points failing to obey obey these certain signs. School zones are huge, and if you speed in any of these school zones, you get double the fine. But this is just the point system, not the ticket money, not your car insurance. Rape me up the butt. Okay, so two points, like I said, failing to obey signs, failing to share the road, improper right turn, improper left turn. So you put your right signal on, you go in the left lane, uh, pulling UEs. <clears throat> uh, failing to signal period, unnecessarily slow driving, reversing on a highway. Well, I've, I've actually done that last week. I went on the, the off ramp to get out of uh, Niagara Falls. I'm trying to reverse to get out. I said, you know what, fuck it, that's just retarded. I kept going and got off way down the highway. Don't do that. Okay. Uh, driving, driver failing to wear a seatbelt, driver failing to ensure infant passenger is secured. So buckle up your kid, obviously. Driver failing to ensure toddler passenger is secure. Driver failing to ensure child is secured. Driver failing to ensure a passenger under 16 years is wearing a seatbelt. Wow. Driver failing to ensure a passenger under 16 years is occupying a position with a seatbelt. So if you get in an old classic car, doesn't even have a seatbelt, that's no excuse. Those kids need to be buckled in. And there's other rules now. Um, this book's only a year old, but obviously you can't smoke with kids under a certain age. I think it's like 12 or 16 or something, I don't know. There's other rules, but those are just some of them. Uh, obviously, drinking and driving is huge. Don't drink and drive because uh, you will definitely, definitely lose your license. And if you get caught driving without a license while drunk, oh my God, you are just like 
asking for it. And if you don't pay your child support, they take your license away. You got an AZ, you got a DZ, the B license, anything. You don't pay your damn child support. They'll take your license away by by job. No job, no money to pay child support. Life's weird. Hope you enjoyed that random video. Peace.